I just need to read it before yeah, we vote. Again? I might need to borrow your phone. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Words Thank matter. <laughs> okay, the motion before the board is is that the board affirms the action taken by board leadership on August 24th, 2021 regarding member Klein. That, that was your motion and it was second. Um, discussion to the mo motion, member Earl. I'm gonna be abstaining too. Abstain. Any other dis discussion? Seeing none, okay, we're gonna vote on what I just read, because I just lost it. <laughs> um, all those in favor, say aye. 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 Those opposed? No. We have one no, Number two. and two abstained. Your no, okay, one, one, one abstain. And the motion passes. Um, Member Norton. I know you, I'll, I'll, unless there's di um, discussion, as the motion is, is read, I won't keep repeating it. Okay. Member Strait, your light's still on. Did you have something? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. All right, you're fine. Okay, Member Norton. In case number 181564, I recommend that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Second. 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 And the, mo the chair still has to state the motion. Um, the motion before the board is that, the, that in case number 18-1564, I recommend that the board accept the recommendations of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Any discussion to the motion? Seeing none, all in favor say aye. Aye. Those aye. opposed? Voting is unanimous. Please continue. In case number 191693, I recommend that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Pro Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Is there a second? Second. Second. The motion before the board is that in case number 19-1693, recommends that the board accept the recommendations of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Discussion to the motion? Seeing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? No. Yes. That was Laura. Laura. Laura's a no. Motion passes. Please continue. In case number 191725, I recommend that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Second. Member Cannon. The motion before the board is that in case number 19-1725, recommend that the board accepts the recommendations of the Utah Professional Practice Practices Advisory Commission. Any discussion to the motion? Seeing none, uh, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Motion passes unanimously. Please continue. In case number 201747, I move that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Second. Cannon. Uh, the motion before the board is that the board accept the recommendations of the Utah, oh, the motion before the board in, in case number 20-1747 that the board accepts the recommendations of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Any discussion to the motion? Seeing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Voting well, unanimous. In case number 20-1757, I recommend that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Second, Member Cannon. Um, the motion before the board that is in Case number 20-1757, um, that the board accept the recommendations of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Any discussion to the motion? 
seeing none, um, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Um, voting was unanimous. Please continue. In case number 20-1770, I recommend that the board accepts the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Second. We have a motion and a second, and board member Lear, you're abstaining. Okay. Um, in case number 20-1770, uh, the motion is that the board accept the recommendation of the Utah Professional Practices Advisory Commission. Any discussion to the motion? Seeing none, all those in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Voting. Motion passes with board member Lear abstaining. We have the, okay, okay, please continue. I move that we accept UPAC's consent calendar. Okay, the motion before the board is that, oh, do we have a second? Board member Cannon. The motion before the board is that the board ex accept UPAC's consent calendar. And I'll be uh, abstaining from voting. Um, all those in favor? Oh, any discussion to the motion? Seeing none, uh, um, all those in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Aye. Voting was, uh, the motion passes. Okay. I move that the board appoints Jared Alabast to the Utah School for the Deaf and Blind representing an individual who is deaf or hard of hearing for a two-year term. Got a second. Member Cannon, the motion before the board is the board appoints Jared Alabas to the Utah Schools of the Deaf and the Blind representing an individual who is deaf or hard of hearing for a two-year term. Discussion to the motion. Member Cannon. I just hope everyone uh, was able to read about this gentleman. He sounds very outstanding, and I'm so grateful he'll help us on the uh, deaf, deaf and Blind Council. Thank you. Any other discussion? Seeing none, um, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Board unanimous. I move that the board appoint Suzanne Williams to the Trust Lands Advisory Committee as an elementary principal representative, filling the remaining three and a half years of an unexpired term. Second, Board Member Cannon. The motion before the board is that the board appoint Sus Suzanne Williams to the Trust Lands Advisory Committee as an elementary principal representing representative, filling the remaining three and a half. 3.5 years of the unexpired term. Discussion to the motion? Seeing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Those opposed? Voting is unanimous. I think, not seeing any other lights, I think that concludes um, the actionable items out of our executive session.